guys. So we are about to make some lunch. Yeah, we're gonna have some salad and we wanna show you this recipe because this is our favorite salad ever. It's really unique and just full of flavors. Yeah, it's super nice, so let's do it. Okay, these are our ingredients. We've chopped everything so it's easier to like put in the bowl and yeah. show you. Uh, we've got some mint, parsley, coriander and some green onion. And then on this plate we've got some avocado, green apples, cherry tomatoes, cucumbers and some medjool dates. Yeah, these are my favorite. They're so good. And then we have some kale, lemon, juice, salt and pepper and some olive oil. Yeah, I'm gonna take some olive oil and I'm gonna put it onto the kale. This is gonna... Ooh! <laughs> Laura, easy, yeah. Easy on the oil. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't know it's got such a big hole. Look at it. Anyway, we're gonna scrunch the kale up to make it softer. Yeah, because the kale is a bit like hard. Um, to be honest, I need some salt as well, so you're gonna have to add some salt for me. You need to add some salt in the olive oil and just like do this. And it's gonna become much softer. Yeah. I'm gonna add some salt. Laura, with your dirty oily hands. Are you um, serious? It's fine, you can clean it. So the salt is gonna apparently make it softer. I love this salad so much. This is a recipe by our friend uh, Zahra. She's an amazing cook. And yeah. I had this salad um, and I just couldn't like believe it how good it was. Yeah, it's um, a great salad. I'm gonna pop the full recipe in the bio and also her Instagram page. You should check her out because she's got such an amazing recipes. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is nice and soft now as you can see. Look oh, how yeah. soft it looks. Yeah, it became soft. It became super soft. So that's that. Um, basically, I'm just gonna add everything. Yeah, I'm gonna add these. All the greens, all the greens to the mix. I don't really go in any particular order. I'm just gonna leave the avocado for the end. So, ooh. yeah, so it doesn't kind of like mash up. Yeah. Lemon juice. Pepper. I want to put pepper at the end and let's mix this up. We used the whole um, bag of kale, maybe it was a bit too much. <laughs> um, oh yeah, I think it's fine. Let me add some pepper, more salt. Don't put too much salt. Mm, it's fine. Done that mistake before many times. Okay, this salad is just so delicious. You would never think to put like dates and apples in your salad. Apples maybe, yeah, some, some people um, do that. But... but not dates, I've never seen that before. It's just so unique. I love it. Let me add some of these avocados in there. Mix that up. I'm just gonna be gentle with them. It's probably got m more kale than anything else, but... Yeah, it's got quite a lot of kale. That's mm. alright. But yeah, this is basically the salad. Yeah, it's super easy. Look how beautiful it looks. It's so delicious. You should definitely try it. Mm. It's great for like parties or whatever. Maybe yeah. not now, but like later after lockdown. Yeah, it's such a great side dish. It's good for summer as well. Yeah, it's great for summer. Nice See, I don't like thing. I don't like these big big pieces. Look at it. I just want to eat it. All right. Yeah, that's it. That's the salad. Looks good. This is how it looks like very colorful and healthy. <laughs> great summer salad. Right, let's eat it. Finally, my Frankie's bikini arrived. Look at it. This is like the best bikini I've ever seen. I've, I've said that I got that in the bikini haul that we did, but it didn't arrive, so... Yeah, I'm ready to go to the beach. I just love how small these bottoms are. You can kind of make them like super G-string, which I like, so it's great for like sunbathing. And I just love this pattern. What do you think, Claudia? 
It's amazing. Are you jealous? No. She is. She's so jealous, but... <laughs> Yeah, I just can't wait to wear this. And I got another bikini um, like a few days ago. I just can't stop buying bikinis. Same. Like, I have an addiction. We're about to do some DIY today, so we're gonna show you quickly what we're gonna do with these. Yeah, I got these palm leaves on Amazon, and what I wanna do is I wanna paint them gold. Yeah. Because I've seen it on Instagram, uh, like this nice uh, house decor, and I actually saw these gold, but they were all sold out, so I decided to do it myself. And yeah, I got these. Um, as you can see, this one is much more better looking than this because what I did is I took a, a very small scissors like that and I just kind of like cut all this here. Like I made it look a bit more better. Like, I don't know if you can see. Like this and kind of the leaves as well. Like that. So you're kind of perfecting it. Yeah. So it looks neat like this one. Yeah. Rather than this. So I'm gonna do that to this. I'm also gonna scratch this part a bit because it's a bit like rough looking and I want it to be smooth. So I'm gonna do that as well. Just like scratch it and paint it gold. Let's do it. This is gonna look nice gold to be honest. Yeah. We came outside on the balcony. We're gonna do this here. We put some yeah. um, paper. Some nuggets. Nuggets, yeah. And yeah, this is the thing we're gonna be using. I'm gonna link it down below. It's from Amazon. It's such a nice gold color. Yeah. Let's do this. Shake it up. Ooh. Oh we my god, that smell. We might need a few coats of that. Because it's windy, it's coming onto us. <laughs> All right. Mm, it looks pretty good so far. I think it needs like two coats. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. We're gonna wait with this for like, I don't know, 10 minutes or something. Yeah. And we'll do two coats and then we're gonna turn it over and yeah. do the other side. They look pretty good. We're gonna do a second coat. Yeah. Are they dry? Um, I think so. Yeah, it's been a good half an hour or so. I just need to make sure that I cover them properly, so I need to open the leaves. Yeah, maybe open the leaves a bit. Yeah, like that. Okay, this is the end result. I actually bought three more um, to make it look a bit more fuller. But yeah, I'm really pleased with it. And this vase I got from Zara Home. It looks really nice together. Yeah. I also wanted to show you my TV stand because I did a little DIY on it as well. Uh, so these shelves, they were black. And I got this vinyl from Amazon, like a marble one. And it looks really pretty. Um, Kind of light and more stylish I suppose so yeah I like it I'm gonna link down below the marble that I used but yeah we're back with some more PR packages I wanted to show you some of the goodies that I received recently um, there is some beauty stuff some new makeup the new Norvina palette which is amazing um, let me open these up and show you what we've got Okay, so first we've got this Lottie London Layla Loves collaboration and these are her palettes. Look how beautiful and colorful these are. They look super pigmented as well. Let me swatch it. Oh yeah, I love the orangey type of vibes. Great for summer. Oh, I like this color. Can't wait to play with these. Then we have some stuff from Shiseido and this is the cleanser, kind of sugary cleanser it looks interesting i'm excited to try this and they also sent these chocolates these are this is like a white chocolate with matcha and strawberry 
very cute packaging, isn't it? I don't even want to open it. Um, so that's that. By the way, my nails need doing. Look how outgrown they are. And I did th I did them like super recently. I don't know what happened. We also have some stuff from Ofra Cosmetics. This is a sugar body scrub and it's pink. I already like opened it. Look, it's got like a pink sugary texture. Smells really yum. And then we've got this B5 serum. Um, fruit acid lotion. Uh, this is a revitalizing clay mask. And then we've got some peptide, peptide moisturizer. Ooh, I'm excited to try these. I love skincare. This is the new Anastasia Beverly Hills Norvina palette. And I'm obsessed with these colors. So many pinks. I'm very into pink recently. Some beautiful neutrals here in that corner. Um, I think we're gonna do a makeup look with this probably like tomorrow because it's just too beautiful not to do it. Then I have some hair masks from Living Proof and these literally arrived like this morning and I'm so excited because all of my hair masks have run out and I was about to buy a new one and then these three showed up in the mail so I'm a very happy girl today. We've got three different ones. This is for Frizz. This one is a repair masks for like damaged hair and this is a weightless mask. Living Proof products smell so good and they're really good. Um, I've been using them for a while now and I absolutely love it. So I'm very happy with these. Up next are the new Huda Beauty lip balms and they look really beautiful. They've got that glitter on them. I mean, look at that. And they smell good too. I just, I don't even want to use it. It's too beautiful. Like, how beautiful are these? Um, but yeah. So pretty. Then we have a package from Revolve Beauty and they sent all these goodies. I'm really excited. This is like a massager, I think. I'm gonna open this up in a minute, but let me show you some of these goodies first. This is like a luminizer primer from Dr. Brandt. Um, I'm really excited for this new... Um, glow. This is the Sol de Janeiro Goldie Rocks. It's so good and it smells so good. Um, yeah, I really am gonna be using this on the vacation next. If it's gonna happen, hopefully. Then we've got this Bioderma eye cream and this face cream. This is from Star Skin. Look at this packaging. I mean, the packaging is everything. It's called like pink cactus pudding. Ooh, I'm really excited. Then we have some hair treatment. Um, deodorant from Copari. This smells really good. It's like a coconut. I just put it on actually. Uh, it's really soothing and like lovely. Then we have some face waxing strips and this is glitter shot. Smith and cold. Ooh. I'm gonna have to open this up and see. Um, this is a massager from Rifa. Rifa? Is that how you say it? I don't know, but look how it looks. I don't know how to use this. I'm gonna have to read instructions and watch some videos, but I guess it's just for your face. But I guess maybe also for the body? I really like these balls. It's really good quality piece of device. Very exciting. I can't wait to use this. Um, thank you, Revolve, and thank you to all of the other brands for all these lovely packages. I really appreciate it. Um, I have one more goodie to show you. Let me just move this out the way. Last but not least, we've got some lovely dates. These are from Dakira. I'm not quite sure how you pronounce this name, but they're really luxurious um, dates from Saudi. Let me open it up and see. Okay, so when you open the package, it's got a little seal that says with love. Super cute. I like this touch. Very luxurious. Let me open it up. Ooh. 
Oh my god, they look so good. These are chocolate covered dates with some nuts on it. I wonder if they've got something inside. I think they have a filling inside as well. I'm gonna try it and tell you what they taste like. I'm obsessed with dates, by the way. Um, and these are super luxurious. Great gift idea as well. Um, ooh, exciting. I'm not sure which one I should try first. Maybe one of these. They look really good. Let me have a taste. It's like caramel. My hand started shaking, it's too good. Mmm! Oh my god. I have to take this for Claudia, because she's gonna be too jealous. Hi guys, so I'm about to do a little DIY project and I thought I'm gonna show you. Basically I have this mirror, plain boring mirror. It's a bit dirty looking, but it's got these ugly silver edges and I wanna use this mirror for pictures. So I'm gonna spray, spray paint it with gold and yeah, I'm just gonna tape it with a uh, With this like on the edges and also use like a foil inside here uh, Put it outside on the terrace and we'll do that. I'm excited. I've been spray painting everything with gold <laughs> Literally my whole house is turning into gold um, My coffee table I did this with the same spray paint it looks pretty good. It was silver before uh this uh little vase and also this lid for the candle everything has been turned into gold and this is next So this is what it looks like. I've put the tape and also the, the foil. Looks good. I'm gonna take some magazines and put this on top and then we're gonna spray paint. like it came out quite nice I'm very happy with it it's got like a matte sort of finish um, I feel like everything is gonna be gold in our houses we just love it too much we love it too much but I like this now it looks kind of like antique um, don't you yeah think? it's gonna be great for selfies yeah I, I made this for selfies you know to take this outside on the balcony you know do the creative stuff in the house we also got this pampas grass for pictures. I got it from Amazon. It's really nice and fluffy. And long. Uh, because sometimes I feel like if you buy it on uh, internet, some of them can be a bit ugly and it's like not fluffy. Yeah, it's good. It's really good. And then I got this little stool from Sainsbury's. <laughs> Can't believe they had that in Sainsbury's, but it's such a good quality. It's so great for pictures and like yeah. detail pictures. We have like a little, I don't know, holiday vibe. Holiday boohoo, Mikkel's vibes having uh, going on. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but yeah, that's that. What date is today? Monday, isn't it? Look at these flowers. They're quite pretty. Got it yesterday. You know, fresh today's flowers in the house is always a good idea. Yeah, today is Monday. Nice weather. You're breaking them. It's easy. It's not my fault. Anyway, um, um, yeah. we wanted to do a little update on our sister. Thank you everyone for sending on your love. Yes, and she's doing. She's doing well. She's yeah. much better now. So that's good. Yeah, we're happy about it. We might send her a little. Yeah, package. we want to send her a little like a present. You know, just put some makeup inside and goodies and yeah. other things to make her happy. She's gonna be happy. Yeah. Um, yeah. What else has been going on? We've been doing loads of DIYs, as you saw. Yeah, um, loads of DIYs at home and kind of like just. 
I don't know. These days, all I want to do is buy stuff for the house. You. Yeah, yesterday I spent like 200 pounds on Amazon for like weird things for kitchen. Same. Like I want to buy like this, you know, like this uh, hand, um, what is it called? Like a coffee mixer? Not coffee mixer, the milk. Milk frother. Oh, I just kind of like hold it in your hand. Oh, that one. Oh, dear. Anyway, um, I hope this camera is straight because I can't really tell from here. But the what weather's else? been nice. The weather is gonna be so good this week, like 26, 27 degrees. It's because it's summer. It's and summer, yeah. Well, next, I, I think in a week is June. That means it's summer and we're in the lockdown sitting at home. To be honest, I'm getting a bit depressed, I'm not gonna lie. Um, Although, we have to keep positive because if you're gonna be depressed and you're gonna be in a bad mood, then more things, like bad things happen. We had that recently. We had that last week. Was it last week or a few days ago? A few days ago. Uh, literally, Laura was in the worst mood ever. And everything in the day just like happened in a bad way. It was just everything was going bad. Everything. Yeah. So yeah, you gotta keep positive. We've been trying to eat super healthy lately. We haven't, yeah. had, a, we haven't had alcohol and we also cut out sugar and carbs for like four days. I think five. Okay. And we're eating sugar again. But during that time when we didn't have sugar, like our stomach definition was like super showing. It was really nice. Yeah. I enjoyed it. To I mean, be honest, when it comes to having a six pack or the stomach like definition, it really is all about what it's, you eat. No, it's, it's all mainly, about what you eat. It's not ninety percent because we've been doing workouts every single day for the past three months. We've been doing the ab workouts, like an ab challenge, for two months. Yeah. And our stomach looks exactly the same. It's exactly the same because we didn't change the way we eat. So yeah. obviously we couldn't see the results. We were eating um, healthy, but we were weren't like you know we were having sugar, sugar and we had a little chocolate here and a little thing here. Yeah. Mm. And then. As soon as we stopped the sugar, I could actually see the definition yeah. popping through. And then, I mean, mm. yesterday and today we also had, like, we started having a bit of sugar. We just had chocolate now. But it's like a kind of protein chocolate, so... Anyway, we're, we're sure. gonna, we're gonna, and we had some date, those, those dates, the yeah. chocolate dates, they were so good. We had some chocolate dates that we oh ate God. the whole pack in one day. I'm not even joking. Chocolate this is this, this, this is how I broke my sugar fast with those dates. <laughs> <laughs> this is how I broke my sugar fast with those dates and I ate the whole thing. Mm. So that was that was bad, but Ooh. I think from, from tomorrow I'm gonna start not eating sugar again. <laughs> yeah, as if. We just like sugars, let's face it. Yeah. We have a sweet tooth. We have a sweet tooth. Like we have to have something sweet after every single meal. So true. Anyway, we what are we gonna do today? Probably just to some edit, more, edit some pictures, usual stuff. Keep I'm positive. Like, look what I'm doing. I'm playing with the flowers. Laura. And so I'm like, like yeah, a, like, like can you child. just chill? Anyway, um, so yeah, we're gonna do some work. Be positive, not get depressed. Okay. Yes. Um. And yeah. Oh, by the way, so Desi Perkins is pregnant. Yes. Oh my gosh, that was literally the best news. Of, of 2020. No, even probably 2019. <laughs> even though we're not in 2019. If you don't know, uh, Desi Perkins is one of our favorite YouTubers. We've, yeah. I've been watching her for probably six six years. We've we've been watching her since the de like since the time she started YouTube. I remember um, her first video, which was like one of her first videos, like the J Lo glow, and yeah. I was like, oh my god, she's so beautiful. She looks like J Lo. Yeah. So yeah, she now announced that she's pregnant and oh my god, when we cried so much. I cried like a I was like this. <laughs> yeah, me too. To be honest, I'm talking about it and I wanna cry now. I'm talking about it, I have goosebumps, okay? Only because like we've been following her journey and she wanted to get pregnant for so long. Yeah. And it's just I such think a nice that this news. pregnancy news probably gave me the biggest joy of like life. Yeah, same. This is probably the, the, the biggest happiness I've had. Desi Perkins has no idea how many people cried for her that day. Yeah. And still crying. Because I cried when I watched all her life. Laura, if you should, you should have seen him, me how I was crying. <laughs> I was crying. Like oh. a... Like, I was like this. 
It was really, really emotional. Yeah. Oh, and she just getting emotional. So, good. so yeah, that's that. That was a great, great news. Um, and what yeah. else? Oh, we want to film the morning routine and quarantine. Oh, yeah, morning routine. But for that, I need to come and stay here. So you know, we we like actually chilling and being together. Yeah. Um, so we're gonna do this this week. This week we want to film like seven videos. <laughs> How are we gonna do that? Um, why not? We usually film one or two videos a day, so... Yeah, we try our best to film a lot, but obviously it takes a long time to edit as well. It takes like, probably like a day. Like a whole day to edit a video. Depends how long the video is. Uh -huh. I guess because we're slow, our camera cut off. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't know what we were talking about. I forgot. Anyway, I did my nails, by the way, last night. I just did basic French and I cut quite a bit of it. Let's see, they were super long. Um, okay. They're a bit um, not really square looking. What do you mean they're not square? They're super square. But like the shape needs to be a bit more, you know? I like it like this. Okay. Uh, we're gonna clean up because we were filming this look. So we're gonna yeah. clean up, um, maybe have early dinner. Maybe have some tea. Maybe have some tea. Yeah, tea is good when you feel hungry and you don't want to eat. Just yeah. make yourself like three teas a day or four. We we sometimes have five teas a day. Yeah. Especially in the winter. Now it's obviously it's kind of hot. hot. It's uh, you don't really fancy a tea. Yeah. Maybe iced tea. We Maybe. should have iced teas. True. We could make an iced tea. Oh my gosh, the iced tea with the the glow. Oh, Magic mm. glow. Our favorite tea. Oh. Or the focus. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that would be nice. Mm. We want to do some more cooking and recipes. Um, yeah, for sure. So yeah. So yeah, I guess we'll go now. And we're gonna see you in the next video. Bye!